hi everyone you are welcome how to solve this nice exponential equation 4 raised to power x plus 2 raised to power x is equal to 20 now here to solve this problem step by step first we will write solution and after the solution we will rewrite the problem in the solution again now the problem is 4 raised to power x plus 2 raised to power x is equal to 20. Now what we will do here? Here we will try to make these two terms the same. So for that we will change this power to its exponential form. So we can write this power as 2 raised to power 2 whole raised to power x plus 2 raised to power x is equal to 20. Now what we will do next here, next in this step we will use an exponential math property to entertain the position of these two powers. So here we will use this one exponential math property in this one term. R s to power m whole s to power n which can also be written as r s to power m times n which can also be written as r s to power n times m rearrange these two powers and finally this can also be written as r s to power interchange the position of these two powers r s to power n whole s to power m so using this exponential property here in this front term here we will interchange these two powers to an x so this will become 2 raised to power x whole square plus 2 raised to power x is equal to 20. No my dear took it to the left hand side here both the terms are same. So here we will make a supposition. So let us suppose let this 2 raised to power x is equal to another variable. Let us suppose y. So next step we will replace 2 raised to power x in this equation with y. So this equation will become y square plus y and we will move this 20 to the left hand side so it will become minus 20 is equal to 0. Now here this is a quadratic equation y square plus y minus 20. Now here we will try to solve this quadratic equation by factorization method. So indeed here we need such a two numbers whose product is minus 20 and whose sum is the coefficient of y which is 1. So I think these two numbers are 5 and minus 4 because if we multiply these two numbers so here we will get minus 20 and if we add these two numbers so from here we will get plus 1. So in next we will replace this y with 5y minus 4y. So this equation will become y square. Let us replace y with 5y minus 4y minus 20 is equal to 0. Now what we will do next? In next we will take y common from these two terms and minus 4 common from these two terms. So let us take y common from the first two terms this will become y plus 5. Now let us take minus 4 common from these two terms so this will become minus 4 here y is left and here we can write this 20 as 4 times 5. Now minus 4 is taken common so only plus 5 is left is equal to 0. Now we will take y plus 5 come from both the terms so this will become y plus 5 times y minus 4 is equal to 0. Now here the product of these two expression is 0. So here either this expression will be 0 or this expression will be 0. So from here we will get two equations. First equation is y minus 5 will be 0 or second equation is y minus 4 
it will be zero. Now first we will solve this one equation. Y is, y is equal to it will become plus five. Now this will become y is equal to plus four. Now here our target is not to find the value of y. Our target is to find the value of x. So for that we will go back to our supposition. So here is our supposition. Y is equal to two raised to power x. So here we will replace in both the cases y with its value two raised to power x. So this will become y is two raised to power x is equal to. Sorry, my dear sir, I make a mistake. This is plus. So this will become minus five. So this will become two raised to power x is equal to minus five. Now my dears, look into this one equation here. Two raised to power x for any real number x. This is always a positive number, but this is a negative value. So this equation cannot be possible. So that's why. Here we will reject this equation to solve it. Now we will solve only this one equation. So here we will replace y with two raised to power x is equal to, and we can write this power in exponential form as two raised to power two. Now here both the bases are same. So when the bases are same, then we can compare the powers. So the powers are x is equal to two. So x is equal to two is our only answer, which is our real number. Now here we will try to verify that x is equal to two is the exact and correct root of this equation or not. So we will verify it here. Now to verify it, it we will rewrite this problem here. Now the problem is four raised to power x plus two raised to power x is equal to twenty. Now here we will replace x with its value that is two, so this will become four raised to power two plus two raised to power two is equal to twenty. Now what is the value of four raised to power two? Four raised to power two means multiply four two times, so four times four is sixteen. No, two raised to power two means two times two is four is equal to twenty. Now sixteen plus four is twenty is equal to twenty. Now since both sides are equal, so it means that x is equal to two is the exact and correct value of x in this nice exponential equation. And last, if you like this video, so don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.